What is up guys, Joe here. Welcome back to my channel and today we have Kerner, Brussel Kerner, of course the follow-up to Omloop Pet Newsblad, which Jasper Stoyven won so nicely up against Yves Lampert yesterday. Uh, but today, Kerner, Brussel Kerner, a slightly easier race I would say, 207 kilometers, uh, but that flat run-in means it's more likely to be a mass sprint. Let's take a look at the start list. So to start, we have the Kerner Quick Step as the strongest team. No surprises here, although they are without the tractor, Tim de Klerk, for this race. Uh, we have Trek Segafredo with yesterday's winner, Stuyven. Uh, by the way, I have updated the stats slightly uh, from Omloop, so you can see Stuyven has improved very slightly. On to CCC, we have Greg Van Avmat and Trentin. Christoph and Philipson are the leaders for UAE. Sunweb have Kral Anderson and Benut. Uh, Team Toast Howe have Terpstra as their leader. Further down, we've got Sepp Van Marker with Halvorsen. Uh, Barry McLaren have Corbrelli. Heinrich Hauser as well on great form this season, it must be said. NTT have Valgren and Nizolo. Pollitt will lead Israel with Hofstessa as well. We've got Oli Narsen here, Moscon and Rowe. Stefan Kung as well, very strong rider he's turned out to be. Uh, we've got Circus Wanty Gobert with Van Poppel. B&B Hotels here as well with Cockard and Debuchere. We've got big John Dagenkolb leading Lotto Sudal. Frizon as well did very well yesterday at Omloop. We've got Alperson Phoenix with Merlier, uh, Postelberger. Um, and then the final few teams you can see, real outsiders, no real strong cobble riders for these teams. I've decided to go with Team Sunweb for this one, guys. We've got a very exciting team. Soren Kral Anderson, who came third yesterday, 76 cobble now, very strong rider, very well-rounded. Of course, Ties Benut as well. I would love to see him do well for Sunweb this season. We've got Sace Bowl as well as our sprinter. Nico Dens, Nicholas Arndt, Neil Zetkoff and Kasper Pedersen. Very strong team, excited to see what we can do. So we're underway today guys and I'm not planning on going in today's breakaway. I'm going to try and keep everyone in the peloton. You can see Bowl on a nice plus two day, Kral Anderson feeling good as well. So we've currently got a pretty big fight for the breakaway, lots of attacks going off but we do have four riders currently 45 seconds up the road. I think they'll make up today's breakaway. Quick note guys, we have had one more rider join today's breakaway and it is big Ian Stannard up the road. So we've had a pretty pedestrian start to the race guys. I've now moved towards the front with Nils Ekhoff. We're gonna try and set a pretty big pace on this short climb right here. Keep our guys towards the front. Let's try and spark some life into the race now as we approach the big hills. So Nils Ekhoff has absolutely destroyed himself uh, pacing since I last caught up with you guys. Uh, I'm really trying to put some pace into the race right now. Let's put these guys up to 90 as we approach this big hill right here, maybe even 95, let's do that. That is perfect. We'll take position here with Kra Anderson on 90. You can see 12.5% at the moment. Let's pace on 90 with Kra Anderson just to make sure we stay here with Aunt over the top. Look at this tempo being set, uh, set by us on the front. I do want to keep it going over the top. Let's go up to 90, try and take position here with Kra Anderson. That is very nice, very happy with how that went. Uh, you can see 85 and just 21 riders in the peloton. There you go. We have a split already. Um, and you can see a few riders behind. They're all waiting up. And we can get a pretty big gap here. Let's pace on like 92. Try and keep this gap. You can see Gurgle pacing this group of 31 behind. Stebar's in this group. Jakobsen. Uh, Nizolo's here. And then we have a group of 80 even further back. So Vandenberg is pacing really hard on the front for education first. I've got our guys on 99 at the moment trying to put themselves into the ground to try and keep this gap for our leaders. Uh, we're going to have to go down to 90, I think. And these guys are going to come back on. Uh, but that was very, very nice from us right there. So look at this gap to this group of 80 who have been caught behind. Over a minute they have at the moment. Uh, I'm going to put Aunt up to 93. I'm going to make a train as well right here. Uh, let's put Benut on Nico Den's wheel, uh, Kral Anderson behind him, and then Cease Bowl at the back. Arndt is going to run himself into the ground uh, on the build-up to this climb, which we have now started right here. Uh, I can put Den's up to 88. Actually, we'll put him on Arndt's wheel momentarily. There you go, Arndt up to 99, push the tempo. I really want to push the tempo early on in this race. Uh, we can put Den's up to 95. 
Arndt is now done for the day. Pedersen is done. Ekhoff is done as well. Dan's up to 95 over the top of this hill will keep going like this we've still got 85k to go in the race guys uh, but as you can see i want to light it up right here and you can see more splits 27 riders in the peloton again let's put it up to 90 try and keep this gap we have 24 riders in the front group so 75k to go we have 49 riders in this group i don't want to do any more pacing i'm going on the attack with ts banu let's try and keep this gap we can now sit in the wheels with the rest of our guys, but you can see Clement Venturini very keen not to get, uh, not to let Ties Benut go here. We haven't been able to get a gap, um, and 49 riders still in this group. We've really run out of domestiques here, so not quite sure what to do at this point. So guys, I've decided to make Ties Benut a bit of a domestique here. He's pacing on the front, giving himself up for the team as the remaining guys in the breakaway are caught. You can see 25 riders currently in the peloton i would hope some other teams would want to pace uh, with us here they don't seem to though maybe if we lower the tempo slightly we have 25 riders 10 look like they will come back on here steve bars in this group though oh my word we want to keep them behind i'm gonna up the pace i think we're gonna have to use up banute here and make Kra anderson the leaders today with a few more hills coming very quickly here we go then guys, we're on this big climb and you can see a few guys have latched back on. This could be the uh, be the end of T.S. Benut's race here. He's looking very, very tired indeed. Let's lower him maybe to 75. That's all we can pace on at the moment. Um, I'm going to attack with Kraut Anderson on the next climb, I think. So the situation, guys, we've got 24 riders caught behind. Jungles, Stebar, Luke Rowe are in this group. I'm doing a bit of pacing with c Spole at this point on the front. Dangerous tactic, I know, but I do want to keep these guys behind with all I can. Uh, and I am going to attack right now with Soren Kra Anderson. So let's go up to 99 into this climb. Let's go on the attack with Kra Anderson. And we can just rest up with these guys now. We can rest up in this group. Kra Anderson looking very, very strong on the Eau de Quarmont. Look at this. We can lower him to 85 now. Can anyone follow us? Greg Van Avermaet's coming. So is Eve Lampert. Let's keep the pace up with Kraut Anderson over these cobbles if we can. Bowl is now done. Colbrelli's done. Merlier is done. And Kraut Anderson is now in this front group of about 13 riders right here. So guys, this group have now been dropped with Bowl and Benutin. And they have over a minute and a half up to the front 13. Terpstra, Dagenkolb, Pollitt. Christoph Kung, Toons, Trentin, Stuyven, Lampert, Van Avermaet, Pedersen and Askreen right here. Let's up the pace. I'm going to go on the attack again with Kraut Anderson. This is the final real effort as you can see. So if any of these guys go out the back here, that would be perfect. Let's keep going on 90. Uh, I, don't, I, don't, I can't go solo from here. So looks like it is going to be these 13 riders contesting for the victory today. So big moment guys, Stefan Kung has fallen from the front group. But in other news, this group are just not working with me at all. This is kind of ridiculous, I must say. Why would they not want to work with Kraut Anderson at this point in the race? We do have two minutes back to this group behind. They look pretty done, but at this point they're going to bring us in. I mean, do I try and attack them? Not quite sure what to do at this point. Uh, the fact they're not working with me is kind of ridiculous. So finally, someone is working in this group. Greg Van Avermaet has come to the front to help us out. I mean, we're looking pretty tired. I can't really pace at this point. Uh, we have one and a half minutes to the group behind uh, with Benut and Bol in. I'm actually going to uh, try and pre actually no, Bol's just not strong enough. We can sit in this group and obviously we do have Bol if it does come in for a sprint. Uh, but you can see we have attacks now in this group. Nikki Terpstra and Nils Pollitt on the attack. I'm just going to let these guys bring them in. I can't do that by myself at this point. I've done most of the work in this group. Let's just try and sit here. 25k to go. The race has been lit up by Terpstra and Pollitt. They will be brought in. Uh, let's just sit up in this group at the moment. Try and conserve some energy. So we've got more attacks here, guys, with 20k to go. It's Nils Pollitt again. Stuyven, Terpstra, Lampert. We will follow as well. I mean, this isn't going uh, going to go off the front. Uh, it seems Van Avermaet is going to bury himself today for Matteo Trentin, probably one of the best sprinters in this group. We still have Alexander Kristoff, though. Uh, we can lower this to maybe 60, try and get some of that energy back. Um, as they go on the attack again, it's Nils Pollitt. Uh, let's just sit on Mads Pedersen's wheel. He can't get off the front again, though. Uh, we still have 1 minute and 45 seconds on the group behind, but 54 riders in that chasing group. 
So again, 13k to go is Nils Pollitt on the attack. This time he has gone off the front solo, momentarily at least. I'm sat on Nicky Terpstra's wheel. I'm going to go to Matteo Trentin though. Seems Van Avermaet is very strong and it seems Matteo Trentin is feeling very good today. Uh, looks like Terpstra wants to attack with 10k to go. Uh, I'm going to try and sit in this group though. I don't really want to go with Nicky Terpstra. It seems we're going to anyway though. Let's follow Eve Lampert. And five riders have gone off the front here. Let's change to Jasper Stuyven's wheel. Uh, up this to 99. Use our energy gel with 8k to go. And these five riders have gone off the front. Uh, I'm just going to wheel hop. I'm not strong enough to really work at this point in the race with Kral Anderson. And I think Van Avermaet is going to bring us in yet again. So again, 6k to go in the race, guys. Nils Pollitt attacks. It's a very strong attack by Nils Pollitt. Uh, I'm just going to stick these guys on automatic very quickly into the final 5k of the race. Nils Pollitt has gone clear. Mads Pedersen is burying himself for uh, Edward Toons. That'll be Van Avmat looks very tired as well at this point. 3.5k to go. Nicky Terpstra on the attack. I can only sit in this group at this point, I think, on J uh, John Dagenkolb's wheel. But we will come towards the front now. 90 with 2k to go. Up the pace slowly with Kra Anderson. We're going to lead out the sprint up to 1k to go. We can sprint at maybe 800 meters with Kra Anderson going for the line. We've gone way too early though. And Alexander Kristoff will take the win ahead of Dagen Kolb, Trentin, Stuyven and Lampert. So definitely a big shame to end that great race with a very poor sprint by me. Anyhow, a top 10, pretty good for Kraut Anderson. Obviously, he's not the best sprinter. We didn't really have a chance in the sprint anyhow. A great win for Christoph today. And so if you guys enjoyed this one, do drop a like and a comment on the video. That really helps my channel out. Subscribe to my channel as well if you're new. And I'll see you guys in the next one.